Hey everyone, I wanted to get on to show you all. I finally got my order of coat pins in. I got it in on Friday, I believe. And I actually got some stickers in for Belima and Tuma uh, off of Etsy. I think I may have posted that video already. If not, just stay tuned because that one will be posted as well. And then um, I found another book. I have one book that I get from Amazon. This one is called Planet. This one is by um, Peter Popper. Peter Popper Press. Um, the other one that I use, uh, it's a um, book of stickers as well. And it's it's not by Peter Popper Press. It's by another, another company. But it's very similar to this one. Uh, both books are very, very, very affordable. I wish I could do that. Here it is, right here. I'll show y'all it. And I have several of, of these. Um, this is my first time seeing this one, this Peter Popper Press. But this one, uh oh, excuse me now. I just, this one I receive, I get from uh, Amazon also. And, um, I want to say it's six dollars and something. This one is six dollars and something as well, and it has a ton of stickers in it. Um, and they range from different things: travel, um, telephone calls, birthdays, going out with your girlfriends, tech information, food, uh, uh, chores, housework, uh, housework things of that nature. So just a ton of different types of stickers. This one very similar. It was six dollars and something also, but it was my first time seeing this one. But oh, there it is, over twenty five hundred stickers. Same thing, doctors and dentist and um, all types of uh, holiday stickers, uh, exercise, just different things for you. Relaxation, self care, um, weather, chores. That was that was gardening. Looks like some uh, washi strips um, yeah so y'all can see I'm just flipping through it really quickly um, sports yeah so see you get a ton of different little stuff in here now I ha I do use their stickers from um, uh, some sticker packets that they have uh, which is very reasonable as well but this was my first time seeing this book so anyway I just wanted to show y'all that. Now, so I got my order in from Coke Pens. And remember I told y'all I ordered uh, I ordered from Coke Pens. And I think it's online pen company or online ink company .com. Um, I'm waiting for that one to come in. It has shipped, so it should be here very soon. Um, but uh, the Coke Pens came in on Friday, like I said. And I went and got them out the box on Saturday. But I'm going to bring y'all down just a little bit so y'all can see uh, the colors that I got. And I'm going to be swatching them on a separate video. And I'll probably swatch them half and half because there's several of them. But this is Hope Pink. Uh, I did duplicate and buy another gray. This is Cerise. And I think how I done that is um, because... Um, I wasn't I had changed my mind and wasn't gonna order from Coke Pens. Then I went back on and decided to order from Coke Pens. And so I had the gray in my basket already, but I had already put the basket in Venice uh uh order. So I put it in my uh basket for my Venice order and I ordered it not thinking I was gonna go back to Coke Pens. And when I went back to Coke Pens, I didn't go into my basket to make sure Everything that um, I wanted was there because I would have removed this one since I already have one. But since it's a lovely gray, I guess that's okay too. And then eventually what I would like to do is start sending people samples and stuff of some of the ones that I do have. And I can, you know, since I have um, two bottles of that, you know, that could definitely be one that I can send out. Diamine Claret. And all of these are diamond or uh, bottles, 30 mLs. Diamine Crimson, Diamine Sunset, 
let me go back to crimson so crimson i'm hoping it's not like the merlot but it actually kind of looks like it might be like the merlot not the burgundy the merlot i think so i'm hoping that it is not we'll see so i'm sorry i just did diamond sunset and this is supposed to be just a deeper orange than like um the pumpkin uh, this is Diming Lavender, and I also got a Sydney Lavender, and I ordered, uh, it was a sample of Sydney, Sid, uh, Sydney Lavender, or Lavender Sydney, no, Sydney Lavender, from um, Robert Oster, and Concord Bream. Noodler's sample and it actually is like a lavender or lilac color so um i hope this is very pretty uh, because i didn't i'm not gonna order the concord green because it was grainy and i don't know if that was that i didn't shake up the bottle enough or if the i don't know the the structure of the ink but it caused some graininess and and it also feathered quite a bit so this one is a uh, diming Florida blue. I got three different blues. Diming presidential blue. Uh, this is diming coat pins exclusive, I believe. Deep dark blue. And then uh, this is the diming gray. And this one I will not be swatching because I've swatched this one already and showed this to you all in a separate video. So let me see how many that is then. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So that's nine. It's ten with this one, but I won't be swatching it. So I'll do five in one video, five in another video. And so you show you all the swatches. I'm not going to swatch in my uh, swatch book and the Rolodex, I'll only swatch on one of them, which will probably be the Rolodex. And I'll already have the swatch book completed and just show you all um, the uh, completed swatch book so you all can see the colors on a different paper than the Rolodex paper. Uh, what I swatch on as far as the paper, the swatch book, is it's, it's the paper that's for the... Jaboon Techo, I believe. Jaboon Techo uses this paper. It's called Thin Paper 52 uh, GM 184 sheets. This is a plain notebook and uh, Kukuyo. Uh, and it's a very thin paper. I always thought that Jaboon, Jaboon Techo used Tamari River. This is that gray that I told you all I had purchased, which is here. Um, so I always thought it was Tamari River paper and not until I purchased this book and read on the type of paper it was, was when I discovered it, that, uh, Jaboon Techo paper was not Tamari River, but it is very, very thin. So, which is good. And you hear that crinkle in it. So I think I purchased another one of these books as well so that I can have an extra one, but it's 184 sheets in here. And I'm not quite halfway through yet through the book so that is it you all i hope that you all have a good rest of your day it is monday uh the 24th of april and uh i hope that y'all have a good rest of your day and stay tuned for the swatches of these inks as well as i still have a set of five sample inks that i'll be swatching as well and then when those other inks get in, I'll swatch those too and give you all a video on that. Y'all have a good one. Bye-bye.